Now we continue to follow developing news. A health warning about mosquitoes carrying the triple E virus. It's been detected in insects in seven towns now and communities are taking major precautions. Channel 3 New London Bureau Chief Kevin Hogan is in Stonington where the town will be spraying pretty soon. Kevin. Well, Denise, that's right. Tomorrow, according to the sign, they will be spraying here on the grounds of the high school from 9 a.m. to 11 p.m., that is on Thursday, as well as the fields here. Now, the also in the past 24 hours, there have been a lot of alerts from the school district as well as the health district. Stonington High students aren't covered up now on the playing field, but they will at dawn and dusk. The school district sent out alerts this morning on their website about eastern equine encephalitis being found in mosquitoes trapped recently in Stonington. The state health department is advising people not to go out at dusk or dawn, cover up, and use mosquito products that contain DEET. When I go back to school uh, next week, kind of just, just kind of just going to stay inside and just not go outside. Stonington is one of seven towns throughout the state that have mosquitoes carrying the triple E virus. Health warnings also went out from District 17, covering Killingworth and Haddam. As a precautionary measure, our district medical advisor recommends that parents provide students who are involved in sports or activities that can run into evening hours to bring their own bug spray and self-apply it. We use DEET. Um, we have uh, spray at, our, at the house. I just try to not go out as much as I can. At Ledge Light Health, spokesperson Sorry, Kristen Magnuson explains if infected, the symptoms of Triple E are similar to a tick bite. You might start off with fever, sort of along the lines of what you would for maybe a tick bite. You might even think that it's a, t a tick bite. Um, and then you might go into really severe headaches. State health officials say human Triple E cases occur infrequently. Those over the age of 50 and under the age of 15 seem to be at greatest risk. And two horses in Connecticut had to be euthanized this year due to Triple E. I've had horses for a number of years. I don't now, but it's just something that over the years you become aware of. Now, if you have large bodies of water, standing water, small ponds or something, if you go to your local health district, they will provide these briquettes, which is a larvicide killer. Uh, it'll kill the larvae. They'll put these briquettes in the body of water. It'll kill the larvae of the mosquitoes, and hopefully you won't have any more mosquitoes. Live at the Mobile Newsroom in Stonington, Kevin Hogan, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.